without a candle. You can blow out a tire. You can just blow off. But can you blow up an underwater balloon? Hey, I'm Mike. And I'm Mitch. And in the Wacky Workshop today, we ask, is it possible to blow up a balloon underwater? When you blow up a balloon, it takes a bit of effort because all that stretched out rubber really wants to get back to its normal size. Like this one. Which is what happens when you let go like this. We reckon it'll take a whole lot more effort to blow up the balloon underwater. That's because there's a whole lot of water pressure bracing in on the balloon from the outside. But there's only one way to find out. Don't bother flipping a coin. Actually, Mike, we're not going to get into the water because we're not sure how safe that could be. If you get some water in your mouth, it could blow back into your lungs. Oh, nasty. <laughs> Instead, we'll stay up out of the water while one of us attempts to blow up the balloon using this long tube attached to it. That will be you, Mike. Thanks. Safety gear on. First, a warning from a man dressed as a doctor. Mike, just remember, if you blow too hard like this, your veins pop out and it's really ugly, all right? <sighs> Top effort from the Mike star. Blowing up the balloon definitely took a lot of effort and he almost ran out of puff. But interestingly, it exploded at a smaller size than a balloon normally would. But we're not finished yet. What we need is stronger blowing. Hey, you heard the man dressed as a doctor. Luckily, we have this hose connected to a high pressure air supply. Nice. And in three, two, one, go! The compressor puts in an effortless performance to blow the balloon up. No problems. No explosion though. Stink. And so, after rigorous experimentation, we can assume this extremely scientific result. We think it is harder to blow up a balloon underwater, but it can be done. Mm. All errors and emissions accepted. All care and no responsibility. Some parts come to Batteries not included. Some dramatizations used. Results may differ. I'm Mitch. And I'm Mike. Join us next week on Wacky Workshop when we do more cool stuff with balloons. Like this. A snake! Huh. It is too. That's fine, Mike.